Hello everyone, welcome in this tutorial session. This is the Visual Studio Code Python development environment session. So here we are going to uh, learn how to debug a Python program in VS Code. It's very easy. Right now you can see one demo program is ready in this uh, Visual Studio Code. And uh, I just created uh, right here. So we will see how to debug it. So the process is simple. First we have to invoke the debugger and we have to set something and then we can debug this program easily. Also we have some useful features. I will explain everything. So guys first uh, you have to click F5 to activate the debugger. Okay so I have just written uh, four lines of code and uh, as you have seen the Eclipse, so you can put the same uh, breakpoints uh, just in front of the line and this will be uh, reflected with this red dot and this is the breakpoint for your debugging. So I just placed a breakpoint at line number 3. Now I will activate the debugger by pressing the keyboard F5 key. Once you press this will show you this drop down to select a debug configuration and guys we have to select the first one python file debug the currently active python file once you select it this will activate the debug mode and your program is executed immediately okay and uh, the control will stop at this breakpoint okay now this is convert the status bar in an orange color that means you are working in a debug mode also you will get the controls for the debugging on the top this is the tool debug toolbar this is the continue button if you press the program execution will uh, completed and uh, if you want to move one step then you have to press this and if you want to go the step into then you have to press F1 if you want to step out that means if you want to exit you can do it or uh, if you want to reload then you have uh, this button also this is the shortcut key for that the control shift F5 okay so this will restart your program so right now we are uh, staying uh, at this line number 3 and if you want to exit your program without executing the rest of the lines of code you simply press this stop button or the shortcut key shift plus F5 okay guys also you can see what is inside this variable just put the cursor on it so you will see the value of this variable or any variable if you are looking for also one more thing on the right hand left hand side you have this uh, debug pan click on it uh, this place you can find uh, the values inside the locals and uh, in this section you can see uh, what are the values inside your local variables in the mid of this uh, programs and uh, you can look what the uh, variables holding the values so first msg second variable is msg1 also you can place the cursor so you will get the values inside and guys if you want to move a step one suppress so f11 and uh, you will be moved to the next line and uh, you can see at line number three the print executed and finally I just clicked on this continue then the complete program is executed now if you want to run it again click on this run debug select the debug configuration option and then your program will be executed in the debug mode again and this is the breakpoint and now guys uh, we have uh, one uh, additional feature we can interact with the variables of our program with the help of this debug console I will show you how to do it so guys click here on this debug console and you will see 
uh, here in the bottom that cursor is blinking so we can give the variable name and we just press enter and then the value of that uh, variables will be printed or we can interact like we can split the variables uh, values or we can capitalize the values so there are some useful things we can interact uh, with the variables this way like I have just uh, selected the MSG one then it has printed the v value inside it now I'm going to use the method MSG dot capitalize and uh, you will see that uh, after running this uh, whatever the value will be uh, printed in the way like uh, the first letter of each word will be in capital case and uh, there are lots of uh, options so you can interact with your programs variable from this place as well and uh, one more uh, thing that let uh, I'm going to show you we can split the values if we are uh, uh, handling some values and we are going to debug some values inside the variables which is uh, the results of the concatenation of multiple things and we are not sure this is complete or uh, so we can use the msg dot split so this will split the values so this is just uh, an example that you can interact with the your python programs variable from this debug console and guys this, uh, this just tutorial for uh, giving a basic introduction uh, that how to debug with this visual studio code if you're working with a python program and um, so guys uh, try this and explore more i hope you guys found this video tutorial relevant and useful please like this tutorial and don't forget to subscribe my channel and guys for now thanks for watching cool it help